a very big weekend in Metro Detroit. The Jazz Fest is going on, the Grand Prix, and of course, Arts Beats and Eats. That is taking place in downtown Pontiac, Friday through Monday. And joining us today, one of the participating restaurants, the Bronx Deli, named Best Deli in Oakland County by the Oakland Press Reader's Poll. And please welcome Mark Zucato. Thank you so much for being here. Hello, thanks. Well, you have brought quite the, the kitchen sink with you today. And you are going to show us, uh, I guess, how to make one of your signature... Our Big Mouth. Big Mouth sandwiches. Well, hey, who are you calling Big Mouth? No, nope. nobody. <laughs> anyway, you have brought, I mean... Everybody's just agog at everything that you've brought, and uh, this is amazing. Corned beef. This is corned beef. Mm -hmm. This is how we cook it. Okay, I wasn't sure, because, uh, yeah, I want to know. I want to know what this is all about. What the, uh, This is a what brisket the, uh -huh. prepared by United Meats of Detroit, and uh, we get it in, and we cook it. We boil it for a minimum of two hours. Okay. And um, after that, we'll put it on our, our slicer, which I couldn't bring for... Right, for this, safety this is, purposes. Yeah, this is what... <laughs> what it looks like when uh, after it comes off the slicer. So what do they call it, corned beef? I mean... <laughs> I it actually know. goes way back. They used to cure it with uh, salt that was looked like corn kernels. Oh, all right. I read that on Google. I asked. So. <laughs> <laughs> all right, then. Okay, so uh, the Bronx Deli. Yep. It's a big thing in the Bronx, apparently, this corned beef. New York City. New York City. Yep. In, in it's one of the boroughs, yeah. Right, okay. So tell us about the Big Mouth. Well, the Big Mouth is our signature sandwich. Um, do you want me to make one real quick? Sure. Okay. Because, you know, Ben is here. Hey, I would, hey, I would hey, say. Our resident Big Mouth thing. Our resident. We're going to. Guy who's running for president. Absolutely. I'll, yes. I'll hook Ben up right now. All right. And what kind of sauce are you putting on? This is our secret uh, Russian that we came up with on our own. Okay. And then you hit it with some uh, Swiss. Mm hmm That. And coleslaw. Okay. Do you so like the coleslaw, Ben? Oh, yeah. Okay. The difference yeah. between this and a Reuben would be? A Reuben is grilled and it has sauerkraut on it. Okay. Got it. Everything else is identical. And this is one of the sandwiches we'll be serving at Arts Beats and Eats. Uh-huh. There you go. Look at that. So, you said that if you eat, if you order one of these Big Mouths in your restaurant... No, this is Mark's Meat Mound. Oh, that's Mark's Meat Mound. How this dare I? Front. I confused the two. This is his younger brother. Oh, okay. okay. Son of. <laughs> you eat this in my deli. Uh-huh. In the deli, uh -huh. you get your picture on a wall. You get your picture. Pound and a half of meat. people really eat all that? There, there are some pictures on a wall. Okay, so how much is that? How much... This uh, is nine ounces. Nine ounces, okay. This is our large sandwich. Wonderful. And what else did you bring really quickly over here? Uh, we have uh, Asian salad, cob salad, potato mm. salad, banana of pudding, a uh, sandwich tray for catering, a uh, deli tray for catering, mac salad, that's a raspberry walnut, and coleslaw. And where are you guys located? We're on Telegraph Road between Orchard Lake and M59, uh, just one block south of Borkies. All right, everybody eats this morning, and for more information on Arts, Beats, and Eats, you can head to our website, <laughs> myfoxdetroit.com, and for today's, today's recipe, just type in the keywords, cooking school. Thank you so much for being here. You're welcome. All Get right. the camera ready. I'm coming in for that. <laughs> yeah, all right. What was it called, Mark's Mountain? Mark's, Mark's Meat Mountain. Meat Mountain. Mountain of Meat, everybody. We'll be right back. Nitroglycerin pillow. Ah. This weekend, take a holiday.